Oh my god, okay. Hey, hold on. Whew. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another episode of Keeping Up With Coco. If you are new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button, turn on your post notifications, and follow me on Instagram at Birkin Coco. You know how to spell Birkin and you know how to spell Coco. Once I get to 20K subscribers, I'm giving away $300. And all you have to do is subscribe to my channel, have your post notifications turned on, follow me on Instagram, and comment down below with your cash app. Also, be sure to subscribe to my Patreon if you would like to know all about my sugar baby experience and how I managed to live how I live. Okay, hear me. Um, anyways, so if you've been following me on Instagram, you have seen that it has been shopping after shopping after shopping after shopping. <laughs> um, so. I decided that I was going to do like a collective haul or a collective unboxing. Um, now I did watch Aaliyah's face on YouTube do this video um, and that's kind of where I got the idea because I also literally that same day went shopping and then the next day or two days after that went shopping again. So I was just like, okay, I'm just going to hold on because I knew I was gonna get a couple more things um, from all of my sugar daddies. Um, also because you know it's my birthday month so <laughs> It's finesse month for me. <laughs> if it's your birthday, that's the month that you know you want to ask. It's your birthday. You're the birthday girl, so ask. But anyway, subscribe to my Patreon so you can find out more about all of that. Um, but so I have been doing a lot of shopping, so I wanted to do an unboxing. Now, <laughs> all those boxes back there you see, I'm going to show you guys everything that is in those boxes. Now I have to go over there and grab them because I'm sitting over here by my desk. But <laughs> let me go grab the bags. It's a lot of bags. I'm not even gonna lie to you. It's a lot of stuff. But I'll show you. to fall over like oh my god okay hey hold on <laughs> hold on this is a thumbnail <laughs> this is crazy oh my god okay guys <laughs> Whew, i really have to catch my breath that was a lot of work <laughs> like Oh my god, when I said it was a lot, you guys thought I was playing. That was a lot. Anyways, let's get into it because, yeah. Um, so I was thinking, I'll just start with like the least expensive up until the most expensive. Yeah, I think so. Um, I was going to do small box to big box, but I think we're just going to do by brand probably. So we're going to go with the least expensive brand to the most expensive brand um, so we're gonna start with Aritzia <laughs> so you guys know that it's obviously fall here in Massachusetts it's cold outside some days it's warm some days it's cold some days it's kind of medium um, so I did go shopping now this is courtesy of wine daddy I don't know if you guys remember wine daddy but he was around in the last winter ish not really the winter time i think it was like fall we met in like fall springtime um and so he disappeared in the summertime for whatever reason and you know it's back to cuffing season and it's cold outside so finesse season okay and so he took me to aritia or i took him to aritia and i ended up getting this really cute sweater now it is very soft i mean this sweater is so 
cozy it's super soft the material is just amazing um, and it's like a crop sweater so I thought this would be really cute to wear in the winter time or now that it's fall with some cute jeans or like a cute pair of pants or something you know and um, still stay a little bit warm I got some bodysuits. Now you guys know that I am all for um, bodysuits. I've been talking about how I want more bodysuits in my wardrobe. So I did pick up this really cute bodysuit. I love the neckline of it. It's like a square neckline. I'm not sure what the like proper name for it is, but it just looks like a square uh, neckline. But I thought this was really cute. Um, and it's a long sleeve, so it's also perfect for the fall, winter time. You can dress it up with a blazer, or you can, you know, dress it down with some jeans or something. I also got another one of these, but it was pink and I wore it already. I got this really cute turtleneck from Aritia as well. Like I said, it's fall, so turtlenecks are perfect in your closet for fall, winter time. You can dress it up, you can dress it down. I love the color. You guys know brown is one of my go-to colors in my wardrobe, so I thought this would just be cute um, with some jeans or some dress pants and a nice blazer in the winter time, fall time. Um, also I got this crop top. Now I had gotten this in like white before, like a long time ago. Um, and I did kind of stain it, so it's something that I just wear around the house. But this is like a perfect crop for the fall time with a nice skirt, some jeans, some pants, whatever, like the material is perfect. Like it's super uh, durable, it's thick, it'll keep you warm. But you know, not obviously not really warm, but you'll have to obviously put something over it. But like, this is like a cute crop top to wear in the fall time. And I thought, oh, well, they also have it in <laughs> this pink slash purple color. Um, it says on it, Rose Rodon, that's the, the color. But I don't know, I thought it was really cute. If you guys might not notice, but subscribe to my Patreon and you'll see. But I interviewed a Birkin Daddy and um, while I was out there, we also did a tad bit of shopping. Um, now, I did wear some of the stuff that he bought me. He got me this one bodysuit, it was white, this really cute skirt, <laughs> um, and then what else? Oh yeah, and then this dress. I think that's all I got from Aritia while I was out there with him. But I saw this dress, and now it's, it's in the same material as that crop sweater that I just showed you, but uh, it is so cute. It is a long sleeve, below the knee dress, and it is so cute. This was 148, but it was so worth it. I mean, I didn't pay for it, so. <laughs> um, but so cute, this dress, I tried it on, I was like, oh, this is sexy. Now, it wasn't a dress that I was gonna wear in California, obviously, because um, I think it, it, was, it would be too warm for California. I got it thinking how I'm gonna wear it here in Boston this fall, or sometime in the winter time when it's cold outside, but put on this dress with some nice heels and a nice long jacket, mm, it's given. So that's all I got from Aritia. If I hadn't worn like four of the things, <laughs> you would have seen the other stuff that I got. Um, we're gonna go to the next brand. We went to Neiman Marcus. Now, um, Neiman Marcus is a store, it's not a brand but I only got one thing from there. Now, if you're subscribed to my Patreon <laughs> and you watch my vlog that I posted on there from when I went to California, the first vlog that I posted, I actually have another one that I'm going to post um, with Burke and Daddy in it. Um, I told you guys how I met this guy on Bumble. Now, we're gonna call him Doctor. Okay, Doctor Daddy, I don't know. Doc Daddy, Doc Daddy, is that a thing? I don't know, but anyways. <laughs> I met him on Bumble. Literally, we met the same day. Um, we went out to dinner. He was really nice. Um, and you know, we kept in contact when I came back to Boston. And then the second time around when I went, we planned on obviously, you know, seeing each other and stuff. So he did take me shopping as well. <laughs> um, now, at this point, I had already been like, I, like I didn't know what else it is that I really wanted. Obviously, there's something that you can always get. But when I went into Neiman Marcus, I was just like, I don't know. Like, 
I wasn't really <laughs> like in the shopping mood, but I saw this perfume and I was like, ooh, I have to have it. Um, now, I did open it already and post it on my Instagram. So I got the Tom Ford Bitter Peach um, a perfume and yeah, this was like $300. Um, I'll open it for you guys. This is what the packaging looks like. It is so cute. Like, isn't this so adorable? And it smells delicious. It is literally the perfect fall perfume. Honestly, like it smells like when I spray it, it smells like fall. <laughs> I'm actually gonna spray some right now. Mmm. 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 It smells delicious. We're gonna go into Saks now. Saks Fifth was all courtesy of Wine Daddy. Okay, he came back and he said, I'm coming back with a bang. <laughs> I'm back. Okay. <laughs> he said, I'm back. Um, so we're going to start with uh, this dress that he got me. Now, I had a budget. <laughs> so he thought. <laughs> ah, he gave me a budget of which I was supposed to use. But I didn't use it. <laughs> I definitely went above the budget. And now what I did, you know what, honestly, I'm going to save that trick for my Patreon on how I got him to actually spend more money. But anyways, <laughs> let me show you guys this dress. Now, um, it's a Zimmerman dress. I got this thinking my trip to Dubai, as you guys know, Tattoo Daddy is my vacation take care of me like that type of daddy so he's taking me to dubai baby and so i was thinking like dubai so anyway it's a zimmerman dress um it is beautiful i'm not sure if you guys know who a zimmerman is but look up the uh designer um but you can f usually find them at like Saks, farfetch um What's the other one? I think it's like Net A Porter um, and a couple of other uh, shops online. Um, but if you want to like try the dresses on, you can definitely find them at Saks anywhere in your city. Yeah, so this dress was, I'll tell you guys the price for this. Six thirty-five. So we taxes it was probably like seven hundred dollars. Now the next thing that I got uh, the day that I went shopping with Wine Daddy was some boots. Like I said, it is fall time here in Boston, so it is cold outside. It's no longer like open toes, sandals kind of thing. Okay, it's boot season. So I needed some new boots. I've been talking about it. I needed new boots. I needed boots in my closet, so I was like, okay, I have to get some boots. Um, so I got the first boots from Stuart Wiseman. Now I have worn this. I wore it for Halloween um, with this really cute blue dress. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you saw the dress. This is what it looks like when it comes in the box. So you have your dust bag, some tissue, and then you have the boots, which is literally thigh high boots with heels. Now I am kind of a heel girl. I don't really do sneakers or like in the summertime I'll do flats if I'm running errands. But like when I go out, I like to get dressed. So I was like, oh, boots. Cause I can wear my dress, I can wear my jeans and still rock my boots and look fire. So I got these black boots. Um, these were like 14, 1500. So that was cute. That was really nothing crazy. It was just like a basic purchase, honestly. Basic, because it's not like they have anything special on them. Honestly, they just plain black um, over the knee boots that I thought looked really cute with my outfits. So these boots now, these, these were fire, okay? These boots were fire. Chanel, you're literally in the way. Fire. Okay, it gave everything it was supposed to give. <laughs> she has to be in the mix. Anyway, so it comes with two dust bags. Well, one dust bag actually. Just one big dust bag, I guess. Um, 
Then these are the shoes. Look how beautiful these boots are. And then look at the bottom. What? <laughs> Aren't they so cute? And they're like suede material. Oh, by the way, the um, Stuart Wiseman are also suede material. Um, so these are boots that I'm gonna be wearing like actually in the snow or if it's raining. Yeah, no, probably wouldn't be a good idea. So these are like for dry, cold winter days so like if it's dry outside there's no rain there's no snow but i want to like dress up and wear my boots <laughs> okay and then these also could honestly be everyday boots because they're not even as high the heels on them are not that high um but yeah i thought these were super cute i don't know it's the red bottoms for me <laughs> now i'm not even going to tell you guys the price for this one because this one was this, this was expensive uh, so wine daddy got me this as well this was all in the same day the aritzia and all of the boots and the dress um but these boots like okay period i love them i'm like i think i have enough boots now <laughs> i think i have enough boots now because i actually still have one more boot to show you guys um but we're gonna get to that in a second i wanted to show you guys these shoes now I'm sure you guys have already seen these, but I bought these a while ago, but I've only worn them once, but I kind of wanted to show you guys as well because it is a collective haul. Um, so I was like, oh, let me show you guys. Um, the box is actually in the room, but I was like, oh, let me show you guys. I did get these from Saks, but I was like, I wanted to show you guys the actual shoes because I think I showed you guys in my vlog, but I didn't really give you guys like, you know, like the actual like deets, okay? So look at the details on these. Aren't these beautiful? Look how gorgeous they are. Oh, so pretty. I wore this one time and I was like, yes, it gives, <laughs> it gives, okay? It comes with two dust bags. Um, the guy at the store said I should never put them in the same dust bag because of these um, like stars on them if they rub against each other like the shoes if they rub against each other they'll fall off so you gotta keep them in separate the next brand we're gonna go into is Chanel now I did wear these earrings already but I put them back in the box so that I can show you guys and I try to wrap it myself So inside we have receipt and then we have the box. This is what it looks like. Now like I said, I did kind of uh, take this apart and try to tie it back myself so <laughs> don't mind me. But I will show you guys what the earrings look like. Bam. So these are the beautiful stud earrings that I got from California. Now I really wanted these. I've been looking for these because these are like everyday earrings. Now they are kind of like extra everyday earrings, but they are everyday earrings. So I am just going to put them on right now to show you guys what they look like when you put it on. All right, so this is what they look like. <laughs> it's like cute everyday earrings to like wear to go out now you guys know that i'm not really a jewelry girl like you know like i am a jewelry girl but i'm not a jewelry girl i do have my little statement pieces like i have my van cleave i have my rolex i have my hermes bracelet um i have a couple of my you know chanel earrings stuff like that but I don't have like a lot of jewelry. So I decided to add to my collection and I thought this would be a really cute statement piece for everyday activities. When I wanna go out, when I wanna dress up, when I wanna dress down, maybe put my hair in a bun and just run some errands. Like, you know what I mean? I don't know, I just thought they were cute. They're a little extra for everyday. If they did have like smaller studs, that would have been perfect for everyday, but this is also, fine I think 
Um, I'm actually just gonna keep that on. Next, we have another small box. I wanna show you guys what is in here, okay? So let's open it. Now, I have opened this. I did my TikTok, I told you guys already, so <laughs> don't judge me. Um, but this is basically just a brooch. Now, I've always wanted one of these for when I wear blazers um, or a nice dress. Like with that black dress that I just showed you guys on a day that I really wanna go out, like tell me that would not be perfect. That would be so cute on the black dress that I got from um, Aritzia that uh, Burke and Daddy got me. Wouldn't this be so cute with it? Like right here now because it's like it's an Aritzia dress granted it's 148 dollars it's really not that expensive but like when you add this on it oh it's gonna give it so much class like i don't know but i just thought this was so cute and look at the bling it's the bling on it for me okay you see that you see the shimmer like come on so cute So this is basically what it would look like, um, like on a dress, but it'll have to go with like my black dress. Like I don't think it, I don't think it goes well with this dress, but like with that black dress. Mm. So that was it for the small Chanel boxes. Now let's bring out the big Chanel box. <laughs> um, this is what this looks like. Okay, um, I'm going to untie it so that you guys can see. It's, it's more boots. <laughs> um, so I got these Chanel boots. Now, I did see it on Aaliyah's face. Once again, I was watching her collective haul, and I saw these boots on there, and I was like, I have to have those. Um, I did go into the Chanel store looking for sneakers because I needed some sneakers. But then I saw these because they only had like a very tiny um, limited like amount of sneakers available. So they didn't have what I was looking for. And I was like, oh, let me look at boots. I saw these boots and I was like, I just seen this girl talk about these boots on her channel. I have to have them. So this is what they come looking like with two Chanel dust bags. And then inside you have the boots. Now I'm gonna take them out and show you guys. Look at it. So it has a CC in the back of the shoes on the zipper. And then you have the Chanel, Chanel written on the side. Like these aren't stickers, like it's actually like carved into the shoes it says chanel like it is freaking beautiful and then obviously on the bottom it also has the cc as you can see i have literally not worn this at all like at all they have not left their box <laughs> except for me to do this video um or do like my instagram stuff but look at these boots now my friend was telling me oh get chelsea boots chelsea boots and i was like oh you know something i do want some chelsea boots but i need my chelsea boots to have some sort of heels on it because that's just the type of person that i am um so yeah so i ended up getting these and i kind of feel like they are kind of like a version of chelsea boots i don't know you guys tell me do you guys think these are chelsea boots or no but from what they look like, they look like they're Chelsea boots. <laughs> I don't know, but I thought they were really cute and I thought they were a statement piece in my closet and I had to have them. So, yeah. Okay, so that is it for Chanel. Now we're going to get into this <laughs> next item. Now this is last, but definitely not least and also definitely the most expensive um, item in my uh you know new birthday unboxing like it's not my birthday yet so i hope you guys know this like these were all gifts from like the first of the month okay and it's only the eighth right now so it's not my birthday my birthday is november 20th so we still have so much finessing to do okay we still have uh, so much more gifts to get relax <laughs> 
relax okay but let's get into this now i am gonna drop a little tiktok right here of me actually unboxing the whole thing <laughs> um but let me show you guys what i got now it did come like this so like i got this while i was out in california um courtesy of breaking daddy thank you so much by the way um so it comes with a traveling pouch <laughs> in case i'm like going out of town out of the country and i want to take it with me i can you know put it in here um also we have my receipt from the purchase inside of it so that you guys can see also in the back we have the certificate of authenticity um, I will show you guys. So, and, uh, so this is the box. I'm gonna open it. So I got the Justin Clue bracelet. Um, I love it so much. It is in gold. Um, and I just thought it was really pretty. Now they did have some with diamonds, like little, little diamonds on there. And I don't know, the diamonds just kind of looked, it kind of made it look almost, I don't know, basic, cheap, I don't know. Cause the diamonds were so small. Um, and I just figured if I'm going to get the diamonds, I will probably do like the love bracelet instead. Um, maybe I'll ask for that for Christmas. Um, but yeah, so I don't know. I got this. I thought it was really cute. Courtesy of Birkin Daddy. <laughs> um, I thank you so much. I love it. I'm going to put it on for you guys. Um, it's very simple. I believe it's this way. Yeah. So that is pretty much all of the stuff that I got. Um, looks like a lot of stuff, but it really wasn't that much stuff. Um, but yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Tell me which item was your favorite down in the comment. Go follow me on Instagram, Burke and Coco. Um, some of you guys get to see, you know, some of these things before everybody else. Um, so make sure that you're following me on Instagram, Burke and Coco. You know how to spell Birkin and you know how to spell Coco. Um, remember to subscribe, have your post notifications turned on. Make sure to subscribe to my Patreon. Because I don't want you guys in my DMs on Instagram talking about some cocoa. How do I get a sugar daddy? While you're doing that, the girls on my um, Patreon already have the tea. So make sure that you are subscribing to my Patreon. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I have a new vlog coming out soon. So don't harass me for a new one. Um, but I love you guys. Yeah, I will see you guys on my next video. Bye.